We got to make it a point to rally around these children. You understand? See, when I was growing up, man, you know, my older brother, he's about eight years older than me. He, he was, we both born in Brooklyn, but I'm a Staten Islander. I was raised in Staten Island. And the uh, thing was, what he did is what we haven't done and where we failed. So I'm, I'm, I'm you know, let me explain my, uh, not explain, but let me give y'all a little insight to what I'm about. I'm here to put a mirror to your face and tell you what kind of bullshit you want. I'm here to call you a coward, to rile your punk asses up. I'm here to embarrass you aloof bastards. The ones that think because you read a couple of books and got a little knowledge, and somehow or another that puts you in some position greater than that of the peoples. Because to whom much is given, much is expected. You understand? See, my brother growing up in Brooklyn, he was given something. The tools for life. So when we moved to Staten Island, games like freeze tag, wool tag, Round up, kick the can, manhunt, jacks, off the wall, seven minutes of heaven, scalzy, dodgeball, you know what I'm saying? Jacks, you know what I'm saying? Handball, you know what I mean? I declare war, you know what I mean? Kick the can, you know what I'm saying? Red light, green light. One, two, three. Let me try that again. Red light, green light. One, two, three. Yeah, okay. Truth for the man. Truth for day what? Mother, may I? Huh? I don't even see the kids play these games. At all. Jump rope. Now, who fault is that? Who fault is that? It's awful. Wonder why? PlayStation. Nah. It ain't PlayStation fault. It ain't PlayStation fault. Because we had, we had ColecoVision. And we had Atari. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And we wasn't tripping like that. I'm still going outside to play. See, evil persists and exists where it is unchallenged. So you see, if you don't go outside because you're too caught up in doing you and getting yours, right? Who's left to be outside? That wino motherfucker that ain't did nothing with himself. You understand? That drug dude, because he functions from outside on that block. And because you ain't challenging this evil, it exists and it persists. He's getting stronger there. Because you ain't outside. But you send your kids outside to face that evil by themselves. And then when they come back, you want to be mad at them because they cranking that soldier boy. But who the fuck is you to be mad at them because little, you know, soldier boys, they do. At least he's talking to them. He's outside. There's no difference between us and them. We dress the same way. I got this everything I can do to keep my oldest son out of my closet. He wear my sizes. It's like he wear skinny jeans. But had he caught up with me in 89, we'd have been, 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 he'd have been, he'd have been getting into my, uh, my pinstripe leaves. Oh, wow. Pleated, hold that, bang. Mm -hmm. And we abandon them and expect great things from them. We are disattentives in the lives of our children in our community. And we think that somehow and then we have the audacity to sit in forums like this and to actually talk down about our people and to be ashamed of them. The shame is on you. Because to whom much is given, much is expected. You understand? You see, it's like you talked about these preachers and they think that the church is in that building. Where's a piece of chalk at so I can do my little, do my... I got better handwriting than Black Dunn. <laughs> the church in the building, bomb. You understand? You know what that building is for? Anybody know what the building's for, what the church is for? What you say? Prayer. Prayer? Anybody else? Collections. Collections? What else? Mind control. Yeah. Huh? Mind control? Yeah. All right. What else? What else is the church there for? Hope. Hope? Who said cover up? Me. You right. No, it's there to keep the weight off you. That's what it's there for. It's a roof. Because guess where the ministry is supposed to be out? In the street. Look at who 
in here right now. A bunch of people that already know everything that's being talked about. Ain't nobody said nothing new in here to nobody in here. Y'all already know all this stuff. Y'all don't watch Black Dots tapes. Those that know MYO, you don't heard my songs. You know what I'm going to come up here and do. You understand what I'm saying? See, but I'll tell you what I did. I brought my three kids with me tonight. I brought my wife with me. Of course, see, they be thinking I'm tripping in the house because of the stuff I be talking about. So I said, yo, why don't I just bring them here so this way they don't think daddy out his mind. Right. I'm going to let them see where I'm getting this stuff from so that they grow. See, therein is the ministry, Paul. Is to teach it directly. Is to go outside and teach it directly. But see, a lot of us can't even do that. And I'm going to tell you why. Because we got so caught up in our thing, we don't connect. We think that because we have knowledge that that in and of itself suffice. It doesn't. See, because you got knowledge and your knowledge is coming into this rickety old push cart. And this other one got lies, but his lies is coming in on an H2 with about 40 inch rims. Huh? And children and fools are attracted to overt power, seeming power. It seems powerful, so they connect to it. So now what we have to do, and see this is what I want to, what, what this is what I'm trying to do in this thing. I want to give you a couple songs and all that, but I also want to talk to you about what it is that I'm doing. What is MR all doing? How is this dude saying, yo, y'all should all get lynched? How, how can this dude come up and say the type of things he do? Why he do like that? Why he, I don't, how, how come he don't style like every other conscious rapper? Why he don't do it like that? You understand? Because what I'm doing is I'm trying to market this message. I could have came out with a verse instead of y'all should all get this. I could have said something different, something less abrasive. But what nobody heard me. And to be quite honest with you, Amaya Angelou said it best. A bird does not sing because he has the answer. He sings because he has a song. You hear me? Am I talking to myself? Okay. So this is why I do the things that I do. It's about marketing this message. We have a message. What well, I talk to you about black, what we talk about before, like, yo, we got to market your message. Because it's a pointless message if it's not marketed. We're living in a world where it has to be marketed. Yo, listen, I know that a lot of you are going to listen to what I'm saying and say, oh, this brother told him out like you're trying to take on the ways of the devil. No, it's not the ways of the devil. What you do when you do evil, that it becomes the way of the devil. It's what you do with the thing. God made all things available to us. The most high made all things available to us. It's what you do with them. You understand? So see, what happens is if you take this thing, listen, we're not, look, if it's, look, it's, let me do it, let me keep it simple. This is what a lot of y'all do. Y'all look at the chessboard. Y'all see them squares on that board. You dig? And y'all want to wipe all the pieces off the board and put checkers on there. Because that's the game you want to play. But the problem is this. You don't own the board. Somebody else is the champion of the board right now. And they playing chess. So the first thing you got to do is beat them at chess. See, because then once you're the champion of the board, you clear all that shit off and say, now we playing checkers. But you can't get on the chessboard and put checkers on there because guess what you're going to be for all your vaunted knowledge? Guess what you end up being? A fool! We sat at the Zulu Nation meeting in the minds of Brother Took Umbers to what I'm saying. And I'm not speaking on it now to get back to him at all because me and him, it, was not, it wasn't that. It was just a difference of opinion. And he just didn't understand where I was coming from. So I'm going to repeat this thought. I said, yo, you know, so sister, uh, somebody asked, remember back when you was there, said something about, yo, you know, should we pay our taxes? And, you know, of course, you know, you got them brothers that want to show all the degrees.